hi welcome everyone in today's video and today i'm going to show you one of the common problems that people face when they are estimating panel layer dl or uh, pmg mg or dfe model i will show you an example this this error is very common among uh, in this is very common in this model and mostly when people face this error they think that uh, the data might not be good enough to estimate this model so they switch to some other model but actually this problem is just a glitch in stata you can still have the output so let me show you an example so this is the estimation that i have i'm going to estimate we have some variables in short run and we have some in long run and i'm using the mg model and i'm re uh, replacing the ec so this command is useful because it, what will happen is every time when you run it you have to drop those new created variables if you write this it will not ask you to drop the variables because it will just replace it so when you estimate this model what will happen is it will give you an error like invertible new variable name so when i saw this error in my own research time i, th I thought that this model is not estimatable there is some error in the algorithm so there is some error error in the algorithm but output is still there how you can see this error output just run this command e return display so it will show you the output this way you can uh, solve the problem of uh, not viewing the results second there is one common problem in uh, in estimating panel layer delay some people have asked me in and in the comments that how to alter the command la lags of different variables so what i can do is so first criteria that i usually use to decide how many lags to add for a particular variable in a short run is depending upon how many of them are significant for me only one of them is significant so what i can do is i can add a lag for this one so how can i add this is l pos variable so i will go in short run i will write l dot l pos so I will add one lag. So when I estimate it, it will give same error. I will do e return display. So now you can see there is another lag. Since the second lag is insignificant, so there is no need to add another lag. So but all others are insignificant, so there is no need to add lags. So this was only an example. The the model is not significant overall. But this was this video's objective was to let you know how to dig, uh, solve the problem and how to add lags thank you very much for watching